they say demon. But this demon works to weary people. It's a demon. What normally does is it affects people around you. If you're a pastor, people around you, they won't support you. If you're a pastor, it affects them, these people, they can be with you. And they, become, they block others who are coming. They do what? They block others that are coming. The moment you, when you're a pastor, you must check people in the church. Check. Like myself here. There's no member who can say he's close to me. I don't, I'm not close to members. If, you can ask even Womali Hori, these ones. I don't speak with them stories. These ones, they come to Mama, but they can't come to me. Even I've got someone here, I can give you an example. Where is Masiane? Masiane. Mas, Mas, yeah. Come, Masiane. She's outside. All right. All right. Uh, let's call Mamraka. Mamraka, yes, come. Um, let me give you an example. Mamraka was in my house. Was, me, if you come to my house, I don't talk with you. I've got no business with you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've got no. All right. Mama, you were, you were in my house these two days. Yes, Pap. Do you remember? Eh? Yes, Pap. What is it that we're talking together about? Is there anything we talk about together, me and you? No. Nothing, isn't it? Uh-uh. If you come to my house, but I greet you, isn't it? Yes. I, I do greet you. Yes, Dad. I say what? The Lord remedies. I say, Likai. Uh, Likai. Yes. If I tell like this, it's over with me. <laughs> I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you that, okay, I will tell you why. You see, these people are very much committed. You understand? If now, I always speak with them. I always speak with them. They tell me their stories. I tell them their stories. And God will stop me on the danger that is coming. There's a danger. There's a blessing. There's a danger. Are you hearing me? I will never know the blessing. I will never know the danger. Because always here, they are telling me about, hey, who won the mama? Hey, did you see whom whom? Hey, did you see whom whom? Even myself, did you see whom whom? What I do, this I've been doing for many years now. What I do, I won't even, did I ever ask you how was the service? No, did you? How many years you are here? Close to 15 years. Close to 15 years. Did, did I ask you about the service here? No, did so thank you. So for God, He's still speaking with us because we are talking. We are talking. We are talking. Even useless things. We are talking. So if you visit my house like this, I'm afraid because there are things I'm going through. If I tell you, you'll be worried. If I greet you like this, God bless you, I go. Because Sometimes you don't know I didn't sleep. I don't know if you're hearing me. So if now I come to you and say, brother, I didn't sleep. I prayed the whole night. I didn't sleep. There was mango over here. <laughs> you will run away from my house. It's not true. Because I must speak the truth when I come to you. So what I have to do, I run away from you. How are you? God bless you. God bless you. That's why, how are you? God bless you. Not because I'll be ignoring you. I'm afraid that what is important, which God wants to tell us, he won't tell us. Even mama, even mama, if mama is here, she will tell you. She will use the phone, use phone, use phone, use phone. Sometimes she will say, ah, on Sunday I remember. There's a wedding today. Because she's going to church. I said, okay. 
because I've got many things to do. And if I've got many things to do, I don't want to be entertained by small things. We'll be talking about, you know what? Did you see, did you see uh, Jamini? Did you see uh, uh, Zikalala? Uh, he's wearing red shoes. Did you see? And what about this danger ahead? So if you people here, you want to hear from God, do not do what? Do not worry yourselves and worry other people. So you find that you have got 30 members. You all know all of them. In fact, there's something that was uh, happened on the other side one day. Uh, people came to advise me to call business people. Right? I called business people. They came together. So I was listening, people talking. So I was asking, is this a businessman? What about this one? Is he a businessman? Uh, and, okay, later I said, I told mama, I said, when I reached home, I said, I'm going to tell those business people to crush that thing. I'll say, I want to work with this one. We need to know each other here. We need to. I said, this is a wrong spirit. So that's why God won't work, because you are talking too much. You know this one, you know this one. I said, yeah, I know that one. I said, hey. So hey, even me, I can't do that, but you know everybody. I'm a pastor here, but I don't know people like that. And you know everyone there, and you know each other. I said, ah. That's why that you can attack one and attack all. I don't know if you're hearing me. Stop worrying yourself and worry other people. Tell you about stop worrying yourself and worrying other people. If you want to be successful, I'm telling you, let's take you go to a church, be a pastor. You go to a church where no one knows. Like I'm here. Can you see I'm here? I don't know anyone here now. Yeah. Because I don't sit down with you, we talk. If we talk, we talk, we talk. I have to dissect now. There's a limit, I say, this limit. No, here, we are going far now. Because very soon you will tell me, do you know that woman whom in your church is a witch? And you find that me, by revelation, I've not found that. So the question is, why God is not telling me? So, for me to withdraw is to say, God speak. God do what? Can you see why you're not hearing? You are worried. You heard this, you heard that, you heard this, you heard that. Withdraw from yourself, from these people who talk too much. Like myself, when I come here, I talk. But I think I talk sense here. Because look here, if now you sit with the person, the person talk about East, what happened in the East, what is happening in the West, what are, where is your faith? Faith comes by what? Hearing what? So the person is stealing faith from you. And without faith, you can't please God. Because he's feeding you with something which is not seasoned with salt. And the salt is the word of God. I'm very happy for you people. You are here today. And I'm praying that God is going to help you in Jesus' name. Amen. I've been with this man. You see, this man is my brother-in-law. This man. To be honest, this man, I mean, is there anybody we ever talk about? No. Tell me the person, I mean, you, you're my brother-in-law. Tell me the person we want to talk about. No, there's no one that we talk about. He's my brother-in-law, this man. But this man is the younger brother of my wife. But for me to take a phone and say, hello, you know what, what? Whom, 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 whom? We have got relatives. Are they not many? They are many. Eh? But we cannot talk about that. It's a waste. I'm talking about this one. This one, uh, follow my wife direct. I speak with him all the time. If we talk about, if I call him, I will be saying, hello, 
you know, I'll be giving him a job. <laughs> it's not true. That's true. Eh? I said, can you do this one, two, three? You will do it for me. I said, can you do this, this and this? It, he has never come to me. I'm sure he has learned that also. He, he has never come to me and said, whom, 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 whom. And he knows very well, if I reach a place and there's confusion, and there's a conflict, I say, let's, 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 let's solve it. It's not true. That's very true. Let's solve this. Yeah, yes. Because I've learned life. What is life? I mean, I say, let's solve this. It's useless. Okay, thank you. God thank bless you. Because right now, you want power of God, isn't it? And there's no, you are talking too much. You want God to speak with you, and yeah, you are talking too much. Sometimes you go to internet on Facebook. You are talking with three boyfriends. Okay, kimo bafun kya sab? Kimo shopo? Kuri with three places in one person. You talk too much that you can divide yourself into three, and you've got three girl boyfriends. Another one says, where are you? He says, I'm Bathy. Another one, number two, you are in toilet. Number three, you are in a shop. So you are, you are three. And sometimes you become four. These three, all of them, you told them something. And here you are cooking. You don't tell you are cooking. You don't tell you are cooking. Sometimes the phone rang here. Yeah. You are answering another one. Yes, when this one is ringing, you're answering another one. Say, hello? Uh, you are worried. And you don't know this thing is coming to your spirit. It's coming to your spirit. You are becoming old in your spirit. Here outside, you are so vibrant. Your flesh is skinny, shiny, because of the Vaseline you bought <laughs> from Five Front Shop. But on the other side here, you are, you are so, you are, you are, there's too much on you. This one here, when you are speaking, you are telling the person that, I love you so much. When you drop this one, you are holding this one. Hey, I miss your call, I was bathing. I love you so much. What will be able to deal with you is funeral. Because you won't be in this mortuary and be on another mortuary. You, you won't be here and on another mortuary. They will know where to collect you. How can you worry so much? Now when you go and pray, look what happens. The moment when you kneel down to pray, all these things, activities you were doing in the flesh, they come to your spirit now. They come to your spirit now. When you say the name of Jesus, your spirit says, there is Johanna. What do you say about Johanna? Now you say, oh, sorry, Lord, about Johanna. When you finish with Johanna, your spirit says, Maria. When you're a girl, it says, Petras. There's Petras here. When you say, oh, God, yes, Petras, I don't know why he's doing this. Why is he not marrying me? And, and your spirit also and says, no, what about Lucas? You find that now you are, you can't pray, your spirit is wearied. Let us all stand today. When you want to pray, your spirit, here, yeah, the spirit of God, when it enters you, it will show you that we can't work because you are thinking. You are thinking about this debt. You are thinking about your wife. You are thinking about, because remember we have got the mind of Christ. So we have to think about Christ. When you pray, 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 your mind must be empty. And the word of God must be meditated. So that whatever you are saying, it must come to pass. So yourself, there's too much many things here. And there's a battle you need to won. When you pray, this come, that come, that come. And now you're kneeling down. 
there's too much here. No breakthrough in your prayer. You go for fasting. Because fasting does not bring you anything. It just brings obedience in you. So that you must obey God. Still, you'll be shown there is something like, deal with this first. Deal with that, deal with that first. And you find that there is too much. If you want to be successful in what you are doing from today, you want to pray, you want results, what you need to do, remove everything that is wearing your spirit. Remove. Yeah. Lift up your heads. Ask God to forgive you and ask God to direct you on things that are wearing your spirit and you remove them by prayer. In Jesus name, prayer. Remove. Ask God to direct you. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Pray louder. Karababa In Jesus' name.